Incoming Minister for Petroleum and Energy, Ben Micah, says his immediate priority is to address landowner issues. Mr. Micah officially took over his new role as the Minister for Petroleum and Energy from former Minister Nixon Duban in a handover takeover ceremony in Port Moresby today. The handover takeover follows a cabinet reshuffle announced by Prime Minister Peter O'Neill recently. Gregory Avira reports. The ending over of a ministerial brief today by outgoing Minister Nixon Duban signified the end over of the petroleum and energy portfolio to his successor, Minister Ben Micah. He assured staff of the Petroleum and Energy Ministry that he and Minister Duban were like-minded, so most projects initiated by the outgoing minister will continue on to completion. Amongst other responsibilities, Mr. Micah highlighted that landowner issues will be the main priority to be addressed. I'm not going to invent any new wheels. I am not going to come up with any new ideas. Him and I share the same vision of more ownership, greater benefits, more control of this very important uh, sector. Mr. Micah said that the country has had numerous experiences in the petroleum sector and these were vital learning factors for the future. Minister Micah said he will organize a workshop in the near future to bring in all concerned parties to resolve outstanding matters relating to issues raised by landowners. I will be calling a workshop or a seminar where I'm calling all the uh, landowner leaders of PDL 1 to 8, now all pipeline landowners, now landowners from section 105, all right? Now, me plan by sit down, go through all the kind of Outgoing Minister Nixon Duban, while ending over the portfolio, said that such reshuffles should be seen as a means of better strengthening the role of the government to serve the people of the country. Thank the Prime Minister for having the mandate to allow us to continue and we will uh, make sure we do our best. Uh, 2016 will be an interesting year for all of us and we would like to work as a team. And whether we are given a senior ministry or a junior ministry, it doesn't matter. You have to commit yourself to working for Papua New Guinea. Gregory Avira, NBC National News, Port Mosby.